In this video I will explain you how the dust particle command works. I will explain first the basic of the particle command. It is like particle, the particle itself, explosion, the coordinates. In this case, this means in the coordinates where the command is being run. Then the size of the of the particle, 111, it means wait, it means from my position, one on x, one on z, and one on y. So that would be the size. If I set it to 555, five, five, it would be something like 5 here, 5 here, 5 here, 5 here, by basically a sphere of 5 on radius. So basically, basically the size. And finally the speed and the amount of particles. If you can see, of 5 on radius, some particles spawn there, there, there. They are away from me because the amount of particles is a low amount on the radius we select. If I increase this value, I can see much better the radius. And if I set it to 0 0.2, 0 0.2, 0 0.2, well, you can see it is so thin, the space where they spawn. Well, so, how can we do more about this command? If we want to spawn the particles on the zombie, we can do execute at and the UUID of the zombie. Using executable items, you will need to use placeholders such as pliers, such as target, and the UID, etc. I already explained this on how to use vanilla commands. And then RAM particle explosions 0 0.2, 0 0.2, 0 0.2, 0, and 100. I will add 1 on the position of Y, and that's it. The speed is literally the speed where how the particle behaves so that's it now we already know how particle command works how to spawn them on certain entities um, even though that was already explained now the dust command well particle dust the first thing we have to know is that now it needs RGB size chord size uh, the, 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 the old size we said before the speed and the amount that's like that so what we have to do now is select a value of RGB for example let's set this dust into red it means 100 percent red zero percent green and zero percent blue with a size of one in the chords at the zombie on one value the size of 0 0.3 0 0.3 0.3 the speed of zero and 100 and we can see that it is spawned red because remember these three values are, are RGB red, green and blue let's set this to green now it's green and now it will be blue perfect but what about the last number well I already explained it but no problem we will test many things this is the size of the dust command like 0.2 for example you can see the points are or the particles are so uh, small and if I set it to 2 for example it's big if I set it to 20 it's mm, so big and that's the idea but we can make combinations for example instead of 0, 0, 001 we can do um, one 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 and we will see it's like yellow uh, sorry white <laughs> if i set it to zero 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 
it's black. If I set it to 0 0.3, 0 0.6, 0 0.4, it's this color, but I am making combinations randomly. Is there something we can do to get a specific colors? Well, you can. Let's see how to achieve this. So, to achieve this, we will need to. I will, I will, I will share you the screen so you can see. And uh, here you have. Okay. We will search for RGB color. A any page, there is no problem about this. For example, this one. Let's see. I want this color, like pink. Okay. We can see the R is this one, the G is this one, and the blue is this one. There are better pages, um, not that better. The best one you can you can search is one that we wrote in utilities. I will explain you how this works here. The harder one and the easiest one with the ones we wrote in utilities part. I don't know why, okay. Um, general question guides. For now, we have these three colors. I will write it on Minecraft. The R 213. 0 and 255 five. so if I said it you can see it has many colors it is not this color why because these values are capped to 1 like the maximum number is 1 so what do we have to do well I will explain you in a paint the maximum is 255 and this means 1, 1%, 100%. This is what the 1 means. So, if we have zero, uh, 255, this means 1. And 213, what value is it? Well, we can divide this value into 255 and it is 0. Um, this value 835 0.835 let's add this into minecraft 0. 0.835 and now we can see that's the color we selected perfect but this div this division and this stuff may be harder for some people. That's why in the utilities part we s we added a place where you can get those numbers easily. In this page, instead of using the calculator and that stuff, you can just get those numbers from the page itself. For example, this color, mm, yellow, yes. We can see that RGV, it has 190255 and 125. We will need to make the division on the calculator and all that stuff, but this page already does that. And those are the values. So, does 0 0.75 1 and 0 0.49 and we got the color if we see that the particles are so big well let's change that into 5 mm, that's big 1.5 okay that's it if we want another color for example this one okay 
just copy the values that the web page give us 1 0 0.24 and 0 0.25 and we can see that we get the color that's how you use the dust command now how to use dust color transition it's the same ah Anyways, if you don't know or if you don't remember something like that and you're lazy to search this video, you can just <laughs> use Google Dust Color Transition Minecraft. And we will see that <coughs> how this works. For example, this is the dust normal call command. Let's search for the dust one dust um i'm a kid okay we will see it has three okay so we can see that we have to paste the next color next to this one so let's go from this color into this color and um, 0 0.23 1 0 0.97 and let's see the size is and that's it we can see that it goes from pink to sky blue where these three ones are the pink and these three ones are the sky blue let's do from pink to green so we will need to change the last three ones 0 0.16 1 0 0.53 from pink to green you can see the last ones are green and that's it there there is no much more to explain the size part it can be changed um for example one in this case the, it is a square or a circle of radius 0 0.3 but we can do 0 0.1 for 0 0.1 and we can make a straight line because in the x it has a small value in set a small value and y a higher value and that's it there is no much more to explain everything the, the particle command is explaining how the dust command is explaining how to run the particle command at certain position to, it, it, it's explained it on the how to use vanilla commands but on the executable items you will need to use placeholders how to use the dust it is particle dust the color on rgb where instead of 255 the maximum it is one from zero to one you can get it normally on any page but we recommend you to use the one greeting in the wiki where it already gives you the values between 0 and 1 then you, s you add those three values the size of the particle between 0 0.00001 until a high value then the position of the particle command where that's normal on all particle commands then the size of it the speed and the amount it shouldn't be hard to achieve what you want. The hardest part is to understanding how to get the color, how to add the colors, and I think that is already explained. If you have any questions, feel free to ask, and see you.